there's the group back there. Uh, we have just kicked off on the first hole. Basically, you gotta kick the soccer ball into a big hole, like in golf, but it, the hole's a lot bigger. of three at one time. Tim's trenchy. Oh yeah, he inched up. One, two, three. That was better. Uh, we're shooting five people at a time. It's taking a long time. We're really pissing off a lot of golfers. Three, two, one, go! Look out, <laughs> Almost got nailed. I'm doing so good. People should probably take lessons from me. You're kicking my ball. I know. Kathy has a special pink ball. It's all hers. pretty good. Hopefully I got one more kick left. We'll see. was a fire truck catering truck. Not something you see pretty much anywhere, but this is fire truck pizza party. That's these guys. The guy's name is Mike, super cool. I don't know, might be something cool for wheels and waves. Today, it's the Toyota Sequoia, otherwise known as a land yacht, or a ship, or a virtual small planet. It's so big, I have to come up with a whole new set of big jokes. You turn the AC on, it takes about a week to fill the car up. It's so big, I wouldn't have had to flown to Boulder from LA. I could have just climbed from the back seat to the front seat. The steering wheel is 18 feet around, 23 feet thick. It's own telecommunications satellite, so that I can talk to my passengers. And I'm pretty sure there's other people in here. I just really haven't found them yet. But in all seriousness, 
it's a big car. I mean, it's good size. When you drive this thing, you really gotta pay attention because it's very easy to travel from one lane to the next because you're only moving a couple of feet. But it's a really good vantage point to check out cool cars. and there was no one to be found. So I called Kathy, and they're down at Duke's. We're headed up north today. It's a rainy day. I have my hat on. Kathy's got her uh, her snow hat just in case it snows. I look good. I think it snowed once in Malibu in all the uh, 25, 30 years that we've been here. Yeah, one time it hailed though, remember that? Oh yeah, that was it. Piled up in the corners. Anyway, so we're going uh, north. We're headed to Carpinteria because we're doing a quick book delivery. Big thanks to Jody at Tide Pools. It's a little store in Carpinteria. She ordered a bunch of mermaid books. It's a really cool store. She's been on the vlog before, but we'll show you a little bit of that. And and now she's gonna have the mermaid books there. So if you're ever going through Carpinteria and you wanna pick up one of those books for a birthday or Christmas or something like that. Or just for no reason. Yeah, no reason at all. Go get some coffee, go to Tide Pools, pick up a book. Boom, done. What do you think of this uh, this land yacht that we're in? I love it. It's it's rather um, rather large and do large things. However, the first time I personally drove it by myself, yeah. it was dark. It freaked the crap out of her. Yeah. I had to make a U-turn on the street, mm -hmm. and then the caution sign came on for whatever reason. I didn't know. Yeah. Well, actually, I did find out I had the brake on, but it's kind of like didn't know at first. Yeah, it's kind of like driving a ship because they got lots of lights and buttons yeah. and that. And the cones in the center of the road look closer. Did you kill any of the cones? No, no I did a good job, but I was like kind of petrified. <laughs> Saturday, there is something very cool happening. Thanks to Kathy. It isn't really thanks to me. It's really thanks to Sean and Isla because they're having a baby. That's true. That's true. They are um, popping out a little pipsqueak. In less than a month. Yep. Yep. And we're going to have a baby shower. Yeah, baby shower. And I'm, I'm bringing some Hot Wheels. I don't know about you. I'm definitely not bringing Hot Wheels. <laughs> okay. You must clean the house, make some I food. I do. Great. Yeah, I I know that 19 said yes, but I don't. 19 could mean 19 invitations. There could be two or three people for every invitation. Oh God! You only have to do it once because the uh, baby's gonna be here very shortly. She might even come that day. Jody had some people in there, but uh, big thanks to Tide Pools, which is right there. They now have the books. Good to go. Looking for a great place to be able to pull Kathy's chili out, which she brought for lunch. 
and chow down a little bit. Look what we got for Isla for her birthday. Are you supposed to show that? There's a dude out here riding the bike in the rain. I'd do that. When the time is right and I'm not alone I will conquer this and bring you home When this world has stopped and the breeze is up When the time is right I'll sing you a song We are vlogging. Look how pretty you look. You've got your hair all curled. Uh, I, I feel like I'm going out with a glamour model. Well, you are. The, going to the Academy Awards. Uh, we're wrapping up the day, going to a kind of an art art exhibit, art show, art opening. Yeah, yeah. it's going to be beautiful. Our neighbor Lisa is a photographer and an artist, and she's got a display at Moon Shadows, which is a restaurant here in, here in town. We're going to go check it out. I can't wait to see it because... It's my favorite subject. Moon shadows? Art? Uh, Lisa's artwork. Oh, okay. I wasn't quite sure. The subject that she did. Which is uh, ocean? Waves? Hello. Yeah, hello. Okay, <laughs> got it. I, I don't know if you can tell the difference on the interior of this car. We're no longer driving the Toyota Sequoia. It's not quite as large. This is the RAV4 from Toyota. They just sent this over. We just swapped it. And uh, we're going to talk about that a little bit later. That's about it for the day. Uh, I was just checking to see which comments we got on the, the last video from HobbyDB. I told you guys that whoever left the most interesting comment was gonna win this shirt from HobbyDB, this one right here. And several of you left comments, but the, the, the comment that kind of stood out the most, it was most interesting, specifically because I asked you guys what, what specific uh, thing that in the vlog stood out for you the most. And this guy known as Carcane on YouTube said, always great episodes of course, but one phrase in particular stood out amongst the last three. I heard that you juggled ducks. That was in vlog 759. Her reaction is great and she delivered. Yes, she did. Alex at HobbyDB did a fabulous job juggling ducks. So Carcane, you're the one that wins not only the shirt, you get the shirt, but a, it, there's a sticker that's gonna be coming at you, but I need to know your address. So email me right here. Ask Fireball at FireballTim.com. Shoot me an email, send me your address. You got a shirt coming at you. But don't worry, if you didn't win this time, there's gonna be plenty of stuff coming. Lots of stuff. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Do what you love, love what you do. We're here to help you guys improve your life through what you love. And we do that by loving what we do. And we do a lot of cool stuff. So stick with us.